Hello everybody, welcome back to Bird's Eye Plays Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I almost just said Odyssey. Wow, I'm distracted. I didn't even bother making my way up there. I'm... I'm sorry. It's It's been a long day. I mean, considering the fact that the first three hours of it was wasted with the Odyssey DLC that I screwed up. Ugh. Um, I'm just, I'm exhausted, and I'm still, still looking for a job. I think, because no one's gotten back to me yet, I think, I think I'm going to just cave and uh, go work with my girlfriend. Which I don't mind doing. Like, I... I, I don't want to sound, you know, like I I don't want to do that. Because I do. It's just, it's a fast food joint. I... I have made it my a point to... Whoa, that made me sick. I made it a point to avoid going to fast food joints. Just because I hate... I hate the environment of the fast food industry. If I can, kind of like in uh, Skyrim, I wonder if I could melt those down to make, how was that? I wonder if I could melt those down to make uh, those iron ingots. I, I hope so, that'd be... That'd be an interesting way to do it, you know, you could either collect the ingots or, you know, farm all those rocks. And... And get all that ore. So, Ivan is asleep on his watch. That would explain some things. I didn't loot him. Ivan, wake up! Or you will be cast into the wild. Dumbass. Must stay awake. They could be anywhere. He's sleepwalking. Is he walking in his sleep? They are everywhere. If we die, everyone dies. Oh, I'm out of Eris. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Must not fall asleep. Ah. Go. Whoa, what the See. hell was that? Oh. More ore. Oh wow. I didn't know it would just show it to me like that. It's kinda cool. Um, let's see. Bro. 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 Maybe. Windy. Storm coming. <laughs> He's awake now. <laughs> Ivan, Dumbass. Ivan, calm down. No. I was flying through the air. In your sleep, a harsh awakening, true. But at least you live. Have you always taken these dream walks? Since my posting here. When I am in bed, I worry about ways we could be attacked. When I'm on watch, I cannot stay awake. Only a fool stays awake all night worrying. You're tired when you get up, and the problem is still not solved. You speak with the wisdom of Odin, Hmm. I will think on these words when I am in bed. Consider them on your watch, and sleep when you're in bed. But now... 
<laughs> I like that. That was kind of a kind of an interesting way to do that. Dream walks, huh? Interesting way to call them. Ah, god damn it! I keep forgetting I can sprint. Ugh. One of these days, I'll remember. But that day is not today! Oh god, oh god. Yeah. If only this could be like Legend of Zelda and I could take out my shield and slide on it. That'd be fucking funny. Oh, that's right, I'm out of arrows. Damn it! I wonder. Nah, alright. Thought I'd give it a try. Ah! Ah! <gasps> Person. Oh, really? Oh, uh, um. Wait. What? Oh, there we go. A row? Ah! She gives praises and she is greeted. For your hearing, I hearken. O oh, ancient ones, great Odin, great Freya, I give you thanks for your gift of savor. She gives thanks and she is blessed. No. Eivor, it has been some time. What brings you so far to see me? I... I have come for your advice. In a private matter. Come. I can't see through the smoke. Her mind is a jumble. She speaks to spirits. I fear her final winter has come. But she has me. Now, let her speak to your needs. I have had a vision. A powerful vision. It may have been my battle lost, or a delirium caused by the cold, but... Describe it for me. After 17 years, I saw my father's axe again. And when I touched it, the vision came on fast. There was a wolf, howling in fears. And then a figure. A grey beard, in a cloak, with a single eye. He bid me follow him. The High One. He calls to you. Mm -hmm. Perhaps he means to speak with you. Deliver a message. Only through Seder will you see more clearly and unravel the threads that sit tangled upon your mind. This will not take long. Eh, yeah, alright. What are you brewing? An elixir to loosen your hur and unwind your thoughts. You will enter a waking sleep and journey to the world of dreams. It may confuse or disorient you, but you must take note of all you see. Drink. If you seek true understanding. Ah, shit, she killed me. Game over. Roll credits! Uh, 
Uh, uh, I'm alive. I'm not dead. Oh. Hello. Hello, strange shadowy figure. I saw nothing, Volker. Felt nothing. Harvey! Oh? Harvey! I walk huh? among the dead. Maybe. Sigurd. Sigurd. Brother, when did you arrive? <gasps> oh, excuse me. Okay. I'm really curious how the Templars and the Assassins play into this. What is this? What the hell? Zooming out now. Is it good? Brother! What is this? There was no other way, Harvey. Our fates are fixed. What? Sigurd! What is happening? What is what has happened? This was not for you, Harvey. What? Oh my god. What the fuck? Is it? Uh, Fucking loading times. There we go. Steady, Eivor. It is Valka. I am here. Gods, I thought I... What was that? Tell me everything. I, I, I was on a mountain, in a, in a violent blizzard, climbing toward the summit, following a, a wolf. Mm -hmm. I saw the gates to Odin's Hall of Slain Champions. They opened for me. Shades of Valhalla. For which you are destined. And the wolf was eager for my attention, as if it were beckoning me to follow. You are the wolf kissed, fated to carry its mark for life. In this case, it might represent your ambition or your fear. Or both. I saw Odin and the Nornir. Spinning the threads of fate. They were watching me. Mm, not watching. They were showing you the way forward. Your life. Your path. What lies before you. And where it ends. I do not know what else to say. My, my memories are faint. Hazy. Did you reach the summit of this mountain? I did, yes. Sigurd was there, wounded, in pain. His fighting arm was missing. Then the wolf reappeared, the size of a dragon, 
twisted and terrible. It fixed its eyes on me and struck. Then I awoke. The gods hmm. favor you, Eivor. They always have. You will have your glory, and you will earn your place in Valhalla. But these portents carry a darker truth. The missing arm, the trail of blood, the beast. You will betray your brother, Sigurd. That is the meaning what? of the vision. That cannot be right. I would never betray Sigurd. He's my brother, my family. The Nordnir have spoken, and this is their message. No, this is wrong. Or oh, you misunderstand. That cannot be right. You will betray Sigurd. Odin fought against his fate. It can be done. But by fighting against it, you cause the very fate you are trying to avoid. is that that I keep looking at? Oh, it's up there. That is a very blank area. Boop. What? You're welcome for my purchase. What did... Huh? Why did that just pop up? That was weird. Let's get that ability. Cool. What does that unlock? Sprint attack. Yeah, so each of these is like a goal. Adrenaline upgrade. Huh. Some of these seem interesting, but not... too helpful, really. Some of these abilities don't seem all that helpful, really. Sorry, I'm just trying to figure out. I'm trying to figure out what path I want to take. Heavy dual wield, adrenaline upgrade, dual swap. Oh, that's cool. Uh, toxic cloud around them. Explosive corpse, Jesus Christ. Oh, there we go. I want that one. I gotta work my way towards that. Okay. And now I know which direction to go. I gotta go this way now. 
Backstab. Yeah, I gotta work my way to the auto loot. Cool. At least now I know. Wait, wait. I want the blacksmith. Where's the... I want to check something. Back for more. Yes. Yes. Okay. So I don't have the stuff. Do you need anything? No, I'm done. Okay, maybe. Hang on, I need to figure some of this out, because there's a lot of stuff it's not really helping me figure out. Okay, so I was wrong. The iron ore is mostly just used for that shit. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, where's the store? Who would like to hear a story? This land enjoy a tale while no one. battles clash. No one wants to hear a story. Is there no one who will go around with me? No. Good day. Hello. What you got? Yes. This is available for purchase. What can I sell? Thank you for selling to me. I will keep that because I need to I have those if you want them. Rations. Smart to buy these. I can fetch this if you want. Okay. purchase don't judge don't judge me really wish it went faster than that A solid purchase that all you need yes Let's see, what to upgrade, what to upgrade. I think I'll upgrade you next. Yeah, there's a lot to this, and I don't know... I don't know. I'm not really fully into this as much as I was the other ones at the moment. I'm trying to get there, but it's just... I don't know. They must be finished now. The king has called for his best mead, so the talks are concluded. It should be safe to enter. Eh, yeah, fine. I'm ready to face the sun. We'll go see him. I will speak with the king now. Excellent, King Stubior. I will take this proposal to my nephew. I believe he will see the wisdom in it. Good. It is all I can hope for. May the... Hi. May the winds favor your voyage, Githormer. Eivor, come forward and explain in plain words why you have willfully disobeyed my commands. Do you mock me? Maybe. I don't mock you, King. I mean to embolden you against your enemies and your own poor judgment. You know nothing of my judgment. You know nothing of my plans and strategies. Sigurd would agree with me. My son might agree with me, but he would obey me. He knows his place. Not as well as he knows his father. Oof. Imagine you are harassed by an enemy with warriors that vastly outnumber your own. What profit does open war bring? 
Would it not be better to work quietly through diplomacy, gaining alliances, waiting until the day our numbers outweigh our enemies and our victory is guaranteed? Do we have any allies to speak of? Or is that your excuse to do nothing? Burn. Your confidence blinds you to so much in plain sight, Eivor. Day and night I toil to forge ties with clans to the north. Very soon you will see the fruits of my efforts. Only then will you understand. Is that all? I'm at a loss with you, Eivor. When I took you in as my own, never did I imagine such disrespect from the child of Arion. Your father was a fine man. Just and loyal to me, he died bravely so that we might live. He died a coward, Lord. A fate I will not mirror. Why do you carry such a useless burden? Let it go! Think only of the days to come, of your future and the victories at hand. My honor has been stained. Until it's wiped clean, I want nothing else. Makes sense. to pick at that wound again. If there is something that can chase these shadows from your thoughts... Uh-oh. Sigurd has come! Down at the docks, his ship is here! Fucking finally, I love... Hey, family matters. I love that it switches from... straight from the cutscene into... the action. That's one of the things I love the most about games. Like the newer ones. They really try, try to do that. Hey, hey, careful with that one. Hey, Vaughn! See you good? <laughs> oh, look at you, blood-soaked drinker. What have you been worrying without me? Oh, and you, salt-cured Vikinger. I smell the stink of a dozen kingdoms in your beard. It's just the start. Brandvi, my dear wife. Your husband returns. Bringing gifts and riches to share. And new friends, I see. Yes. Basim and Hytham. We met in Miklagant, and they showed me her buried secrets. Uh-oh. We are grateful to Sigurd for his invitation and eager to pay tribute to your king. My brother is always very careful with the company he keeps. You're standing safely beside him. He must like you. Ah, Eivor. Save the introductions until our bellies are full. I will see my knives. father. Tell him of my time away. So I wonder... Are they assassins? This or are they Templars? We with a ship passing south. They told us Eivor the wolf kissed was captured by Kyrtvis men. They must have cut the tale short. I killed my captors and recovered my crew. And for that, your father scolded me. You know where I stand, brother. Nothing short of war will dislodge Kjotve from our lands. But he disagrees. I know. I know. Father thinks too much and acts too little. Today that changes. I promise you. Uh -huh. By the winter's end, the name Kjotve the crew will be a curse on the lips of a drunken fool. So yeah, I wonder which ones they are, if they're Templars or Assassins. I'm very curious now. My son! Welcome home! Uh, father... Tonight we feast and celebrate your return, Sigurd. The tables are laid with barley and lamb, bread and mead. And no more, I beg you. I want nothing you would not serve a thrall. Let me be the one to honor you. I bring gifts and tales from faraway lands. After two winters away, I am full up with both. Very well, very well. Come inside. And when we are fat and satisfied, Father, we will talk of Kyrtve and his clan, and how we may end their terror. Once and for all, he has dogged us <laughs> too long, shamed us for too many seasons. I know this. Eivor knows this. It ends now. Yes, 
Yes, of course, when the time is right. And the time is right now, because I need to end this episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. Next time on Bird's Eye, hopefully we'll be able to figure out exactly who those guys are. So anyways, I'll see you guys next time.